Guys, we have our own painting now, and you guys can pick who you want to give it to, or you can even keep it for yourself. But I absolutely, absolutely, I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Could you explain, please, and spell it? Absolutely means I got nothing. I'm waiting. I missed. <laughs> Good morning, friends. We're back for another Saturday of What's the show. Watching me on the TV. Watching you on the TV. <laughs> Little Miss Iris and me. Every Saturday morning. Guys, today we have a Valentine's Day project. We're excited to share it with you. We're gonna end up helping you create your own Valentine's present and you can give it away to somebody else if yeah. you want. Yeah, that's true, like mom or dad. Yeah. Or my brother, or sister. Or your teacher too. Grandma, grandpa. Yeah. yeah, so we're gonna end up doing that today. We're gonna use some paint. We're gonna use some scissors. Stencil. We're gonna create. We're gonna make our own stencil. Yeah. Iris, we're gonna make our own stencil. We're gonna make a heart. We're gonna be able to, uh, see, what else do we need? We need a Sharpie paint, or, paint, okay, yeah. Pencil, I I said that. scissors. I said that. Canvas, paper. Canvas or paper. Tape. Something that you can put on. Oh yeah, and, and have your tape. tape. Have your tape. Gotta have some tape. Because this is for our stencil that we're gonna make. So if you guys are ready, gather up all of your supplies, have your breakfast, get ready to have a great Wait, time. I, I already had breakfast? I Did missed you? it. Did you? I well, missed my breakfast. Oh man, you slept. Why didn't too you late. make me breakfast this morning? <laughs> I'll make you some here as soon as the show is over, okay? You better. Okay, pretty please. Some strawberries maybe? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Alright, you guys, let's get started on Wait, our Valentine's Day. Knock knock. Knock knock. Is this time for a knock knock joke? Knock knock! Open the door! Who's there! Luke! Luke who? Luke who got you a Valentine's Day card. Luke who got me a Valentine's Day card? Yeah, where's mine? Where's mine? Where's mine? Um, I'm working on yours. What? You got me a card? Aww. Iris, thank you. That was so thoughtful Okay, of my you. turn. Me, 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 me. Do I read it? Oh yeah, I guess you can read it. It says Judy on from Lil Iris. Show him, show him what it looks like. It's really cool. Oh, it's a heart. Happy Valentine's Day. And it's a heart. Oh, Iris, thank you so much. Yeah, that was really good. I love Valentine's Day. It always Okay, me, 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 me. What? Where's my card? I just told you. I'm working on it still. Come on. No, well, don't be upset. Sometimes some gifts take a little longer than others, right? So let's get together and let's get started on our tree of love painting. Iris! All right, guys, so the very first thing I want you to do is I want you to grab just a piece of paper. So ask mom and dad for just- Just like a regular piece of paper? Yep, it doesn't need to have lines or anything on it. Uh, well, I guess it could actually. Yeah, just, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, we're gonna use just a piece of paper. We're gonna make our own stencil. We're gonna literally fold it right in half. Yeah, fold it in half. Corner to corner. Corner, corner to corner. To corner, okay? And then you're, you're, take you're one You're blocking, side. you're blocking me. Nobody oh. can see me. Oh. No, oh. Nobody can see me Sorry right about now. that, sorry about that. So. We're gonna take this piece of paper, yep. and we're gonna draw just a half of a heart. That's not a heart. It's a half of a heart. So when we cut it, we'll open it. Oh, I see, really okay. cool. Okay. Really cool, really cool. So we're gonna cut it. So grab your scissors once you have this trace. Now, I didn't use anything to trace this. I just thought to myself, a half of a heart, and I grabbed my Sharpie and I drew it on here, and I used the whole piece of paper. So, That's a really good idea. Where'd you learn that? Um, I, you know, I probably learned it from an art teacher or an elementary school. I bet you learned it when you were in school. One of the most long, 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 watch long it. time ago. Watch it. <laughs> watch the. Oh, that was a good one right there. That's pretty good. You talk 
over me a lot. It's hard for me to get in a word sometimes. Nah. So I'm just tracing it out, you guys. We're gonna make our own stencil. So you're cutting both sides? Yes, I'm cutting with it folded. Keep the piece folded. And then we're gonna use the piece that we have left for our stencil. Meanwhile, what you end up having is, hey. Hey, that looks like mine. Hey. You know what you can do with that, right? Tell me. Make me a card. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good right there. Maybe you good. could use this No, one no, what are you gonna and do? And make someone you else give, a card. You need to give it to your mom, okay. your dad, okay. or both. All right, so you have this leftover, guys. Feel free to write a card. One of my most favorite cards. It was in third grade, Sky Ranch Elementary, Mrs. Webb's class. Miss okay. Webb? I loved her. I don't I know who that is. Loved Mrs. Webb. Okay. So I have my stencil, you guys, but I ended up accidentally cutting the bottom. Oh no. But it's okay. I'm just going to grab a piece of tape. Maybe you can tape it. And I'm going to take those two corners right here, the tip, and put them together right there. So I have my heart. And then we're going to tape it to the canvas, okay? Then what are we going to do? So let me tell you about Miss Webb. Miss Webb. It was Valentine's Day, and you know in elementary school, Iris, you end up doing decorating your boxes. Do you get to do like a box? Oh, yeah, for Valentine's Day. Yeah, yeah. And so um, it was Valentine's, and she wanted us to make a card, and maybe for our parents or whoever yeah. we wanted. Man, yeah. I couldn't think of anything. Did you get lots of Valentine's when you were little? I think I did. Of course, my friends were so nice. Do you get some when you're at school? You know who my favorite Valentine is? Who? It's not who. Oh, it's what? 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 Candy. Oh, <laughs> yeah. What's your favorite Valentine candy, Iris? Mm -hmm. I think my best, my favorite, is probably sweet tarts. Oh, you like the sweet tarts? I huh? love some me I some like sweet tarts. I like the chocolate. Yeah, Lord that's really me. good, too. All right, so I've got it taped together, guys, so we end up having a heart. So we're going to hold it up here. And I'm just going to take my stencil right Wait, here. My oh. If you don't mind holding that corner, I'll do this corner, Iris. You got the tape? Yep. So my story is I go to Miss Webb and I say, I don't know what to put in my card. Like, I'm trying to, you know, I have a really creative, I wanted to be different. I didn't want to say happy Valentine's Day. Yeah, so it's good to be said, different. She said, draw some lettuce on the front of your card. Lettuce? lettuce. Like what you eat? Yeah. Like, draw a head of lettuce. Interesting. So I did. And then she says, now right underneath it, let us be Valentines. <laughs> oh, that's pretty good. That's a smart teacher right, right? there. Right? All right, thank you. I Iris. bet she likes jokes. She was so nice. Did you tell jokes in her class? I probably didn't talk very much, Iris. I actually was a pretty quiet little girl. Were you shy? Yes. Yeah. How about you? Are you shy? Yeah. Teaser. Ah, uh, maybe a little bit. So I'm gonna tape each corner down real well. I want it to be nice and smooth because we're gonna paint inside the heart, okay? I know it's kind of hard to see on the camera. We're gonna paint inside of the heart. Maybe we should do a close up. We can do that. So you guys can see. You guys can see it, okay? Everybody good? Huh? Can you, can you see me? <laughs> you like to get up there in that camera, don't you? Peter, you know, I gotta, gotta take care of the fans, you know? Yeah, make sure those fans... Hey, I got one more fan last week. You got a new fan? I did, I got a new one. Does your fan have a name? Maybe. Special, special fan, huh? Yeah. All I, right. think his, I think I think his name's Brian? Brian? Or Ryan? Yeah, I'm not real sure. Okay, so we've got it on there. Now let me take a quick picture so you can see what it looks like up close. So now we're ready to start our painting. We have our stencil applied. I've taped each corner and all we need to do now is fill in the heart with the colors of your choice. I'm going to use red. What about pink? I like pink too. Okay. Well, like kind of like my nose. Yeah, just like your nose. Well, we can grab some of that. It's like a cowgirl coral. I grabbed marquee red, which is a color from DIY paint. I also grabbed kissing booth, which is like our fuchsia. Ooh, kissing booth. Kissing booth. I knew you were going to say that. Every time you're so on me. <laughs> we can also add some cowgirl coral, which is the color of Iris's nose if we want to. The first thing you do, guys, we just start filling it in. And guess who's using her fingers today? You. It's me. 
Are you going to use your fingers today? Do you have to use your fingers? You do not have to use your fingers. If mom and dad, or if you would rather just use a brush, feel free. Basically, we're going to fill this in. Okay, we've, so we've made our own stencil, so it's going to look really nice. And then we're going to pull the stencil off. Then we'll paint the trunk. Okay, we'll get trunk, some brown, like an elephant? Like a tree. And we're going to do oh, the tree, tree trunk. of love. And you're I thought you were like going to paint it like an elephant shaped as a heart or something. Actually, it's not a bad idea. It's interesting that your mind would go that direction. Well, you said it's trunk, true. and elephants have trunks. I told trunks, you we were doing you know. a tree. I just think I want to dabble. Well, that's a good idea. Like a polka like dot. Like, you don't have to fill it all in. No, like a polka dot. Well, you know what else you could use? Tell me. If you didn't want to get your hands dirty. Tell me. Sponge. Yeah, Remember we did oh, our sponge, sponge too. Finger? Or you can use um, maybe like an eraser on a pencil. Okay, you could do that. That's an awesome idea. Yeah. You could use. We've used forks. We've used spoons. Oh, spoons! Spoon right? Spoon would work. We've used all kinds of things, but I kind of want like a polka dot look. So I'm taking my two fingers and I'm literally just tapping, and I'm going all the way up to the stencil, you guys. But not under it. No. Not under it. So is it okay if you get paint on the stencil? Sure thing. The pit, the stencil just leaves the outline. We're gonna just throw that away. And don't worry about getting it covered because we want to be able to see the circles. If you're so doing... you're just like tap 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 tap. I do that a lot. I just tap. We even tap 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 when we made our robots. We tapped when we made our Earth last week when we did our solar system. I hope you guys are enjoying our projects, but we would love to know if you have any suggestions. Yeah, send us some pics. We would love if you want to share some ideas. Or maybe us. you can give us an idea. We yeah, that'd be really cool. Then we could cool? like we could like do your idea. Yeah. That would be awesome. We could dedicate the idea and say so and so sent us an idea. Oh yeah. Yeah, let's do that. I'd also love it if you guys would share with your teachers at school. What? Yeah. You mean like they have art class and stuff at school? Yeah, wouldn't that be fun? If that they... would be awesome! <laughs> if they took you to school and said, you guys, you got to see Miss Iris. You'd go like, hey, teacher, I got this, or Miss, whatever your name is. What's your teacher's name, honey? Um, I, I, I don't know. I'm not in school. You're so silly. But you can say, Miss Teacher, come, I have a question. Yeah, you gotta raise your hand like, like this, like, hello, teacher, hello, 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 hello. Well, no, you would probably wait, raise your hand and then wait to be called. Oh, yeah, 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 you can't say anything. Yeah. You just gotta go like this. And, and then she would say, <coughs> yes. <coughs> no, don't do that. No, don't do that either. Okay, okay, no, okay. No, 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 no. That's not how it works. You have to be polite and you have to wait your turn to speak. Yeah, that's true. All right. Do you think I should add some cowgirl coral? I need. You need some pink for oh, sure. Yeah. Let me grab my pink right here. Where are you going? I'm just gonna grab. Oh, it's so my turn. My my turn. I take over now. Hello. All right. Go ahead. My name is Little Dion. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, Iris. Little Dion. Is that what you want to be? No. You want to be Little Dion? You want to be Iris. So this is now the cowgirl coral. See how close it is to Iris's nose? Oh. It's pretty close. All right, so now I'm just going to do the lightest color, and we're already, you can already see that we're forming our circle. Does it matter if it's wet or not? Do you have to wait till it's dry? For what? To put the pink on. No. Do it all when it's wet so it blends together. It almost looks like tiny little flowers. It kind of mixes together a little bit, doesn't it? I like it that way, but you can wait if you want to. If you want to do each color separately and let each one dry, that would work as well. So the pink's kind of like pink. Hmm. Kind of lost my train of thought. It's okay. It happens to me. Trust me. It must be an age thing, Iris. We're getting older. So, have you ever been to a Valentine's Day dance? Yeah. I went with my dad one time. Yeah? Yeah, I was like the daddy. Daddy kid dance, yeah, daddy, daddy me dance. Like a daddy and daughter. Yeah. It was really fun. We yeah. won the competition, of course. Ooh, you and dad. Oh, yeah. You and dad did a dance off? Yeah, oh, yeah, big dance off. Did you do the robot? You know it. Oh, That's pretty much what, what, what is the competition? Look at this. My dad does the best robot ever. Well, let's get him on here. Oh, uh, no, he's let's pretty shy. Let's get him on here. He's pretty shy. I don't think he'll come on. All right, guys, look, we have our heart now. So what we have to do is we'll pull the stencil off. 
Or should we wait till it dries or should we pull it off now? I think you should pull it off now. All right. Pull it off, kind of like, you know, kind of like, like a band aid. Like a band aid. Like a band aid, just rip it off. Oh, I don't know if I want to rip it off. Or you can go slow, it's all right. Whatever you want to do. I think I'll go slow and make sure I don't make a mess. You hold the camera. I got it, I got it, I got it. Got it. Whoa! It's so pretty! Now show them that, show them that, show them the tip. Okay, so this is the stencil. You can reuse it several times. You can use it as a frame for your face and have your mom take your picture. That's actually a pretty good picture. Here's we should one do for that. Iris. Ah! All right, so let's dry. We'll go have um, maybe some strawberries, maybe a yeah, little bit Yeah, it's breakfast fruit. time! When we come back, have your brushes ready, maybe a little bit of brown paint, and we're gonna paint a trunk and it'll look like it's a tree. Oh, it's like a tree! It's a, I said it was the tree of love. Oh, you already said that? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You know how she is about love? Tree of love! Ooh. So we're ready to do our trunk on the tree of love. I grabbed- Tree of love? You got it. I grabbed a brown color called layered chocolate. That sounds fantastic. Mm, layered chocolate. Can I eat this it? This is paint. We don't, we're not gonna eat the paint. So grab what? a paintbrush. I'm actually gonna use one that looks like a fan but you can use any kind that you have. Do It'll they, work perfect. Do they call it the fan brush? It's actually called the cheerleader. This one. This that is the Turquoise makes, Cyrus collection. That's very confusing. No, it's the cheerleader because it's the oh, fan. Oh, fan! Hello! Like it's, a fan, like in the yeah. sports. Oh, I yes. get it. That's pretty good. Yeah. That's pretty clever. Thank you. Uh, it's, it's, it's part of a pack called the team, and then the team has the cheerleader. Oh, the team, the fan, the, the cheerleader. Boss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so let's start here. All right, guys, you can't miss this up, but you're just gonna do a tree trunk, okay? And then add some branches. So I'm gonna start down here at the bottom. And I'm just gonna kinda go up. I'm gonna do it down here. We'll fill it in. We'll fill it in. We're just gonna do kind of an outline. Go all the way up. And then we'll just do a few branches and we'll fill the trunk in also, okay? It's a really skinny trunk. Oh yeah, it is. But I said we'd fill it in. Okay, it's just gonna be like. Oh, a... you're gonna add more paint. That's what you oh, mean by yeah. fill in. Yeah. I got you. Yeah. Let's fill it in. So are you sure it can have a, like a little bit of that paint? Honey. <laughs> I know the name is delicious, but I don't want you eating. Oh hey, I got a joke. You I got do? a Valentine's Day joke. I you guys want one? Here, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ready? Are you ready? Yeah. Give it to me, girl. Let's hear some enthusiasm. I'm ready! Yeah! Yeah! Okay, okay. What did the stamp say to the envelope on Valentine's Day? What did the stamp say to the envelope yeah. on Valentine's Day? Right. What did the stamp say to the envelope on Valentine's Day? I love your glue. No. I'm stuck on you. Oh. I need a stamp stuck in the book. That's, <laughs> that's a, a pretty good one. Yeah, I, I didn't write that myself, but. Oh, you didn't? I mean, I probably could have. You could have, because uh, you're so clever. Yeah, I'm pretty clever. It's pretty good one. Very good. I like oh, that. Oh, wait, one. I got another one. Now, you guys, are you writing these jokes down? You guys should be collecting all these jokes. Ms. Yeah, Iris you should is, write these down. Miss Iris is pretty good with those jokes. Are you ready? Yeah. I got another Let's one. hear the next one. I'm just working what on What did the cucumber say to the pickle? What did the cucumber say to the pickle? Yeah, cucumber. I feel like it has something to- To the pickle. You've got oh, vegetables no, that that talk? Yeah. Yeah, all veggies talk. Maybe I would like them better if they talked to each other, right? And were my friends. Oh, sorry, I got sidetracked. Something about a deal? Because I like deal pickles. That's my favorite. You, you like sweet pickles? Okay, I guess I'm not saying it again because you took forever to answer the question. I got distracted. I like pickles. What did the cucumber say to the pickle? You mean a great deal. You to mean me. a great <laughs> deal to me. Deal, get it? I pickle, it deal, pickle, deal, 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 pickle, big. Yeah, that, yeah, I think that, they get that's it. pretty good. I think they get it, sis. What do you think of my tree? Hey, that's looking really good. I love it. It's my tree of love. Guys, and just you know like that. What does it need? Need some grass. Okay. Think you can put some grass? Man. Or maybe like a tree swing or something. You a know, tree so, swing? so when you're sitting underneath the tree of love, you're sitting with your 
tree of Husband love. or wife or boyfriend or girlfriend. Or your it. best friend. Or your, or your best friend, yeah, that'll work. All right, so we want to put some grass down around. Yeah, put some grass. And then I'm going to have this wonderful painting that I can give to anybody that I want to for Valentine's Day. Maybe my grandma. I miss my grandma. What about my present? I'm still working on yours. How about this? Mm, that looks really good. Okay. What do you guys think? Do you guys like I it? I can't wait to see your photos. This is you. a really easy project. If you decide to do this, please share your photos with me. I really, really want to see your photos as well. You can give it to your mom or your dad, and they'll probably give you lots of candy for that. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're almost about finished. Wait, is that it? We're gonna have some birds or something. Well, honey. Man, there's tons of things you can there's add. There's tons of things you can add. You can fill a out swing, the entire scene. You could a also. A squirrel, a could, dog, a cow. Shh, shh. You could do the background blue if you wanted to. You could paint the whole background blue. You could do the whole thing grass. But I really, really, really just wanted the heart that we stenciled on and I wanted the tree trunk to really stand out too. But I love your suggestion of the grass. I think that looks really good and I can't wait to give this to somebody very special. Me, 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 Maybe. What are we going to do next week, Iris? What are we going to do next week? I have no idea. I don't either. Let's go. Um, let's go take a walk. Maybe walk Abby for a little while. Yeah, we while. probably should like, you know, talk about it. And yeah. You know, try to figure it out. Yeah, we're going to go take Abby for a walk. We're going to let this dry, and we'll be back with our plan for next week so you guys can be prepared. You hear that music? It's like it's like salsa music. Do you hear it? No. What, what, what plan are you on? I can't hear the music in my oh. head. Oh. Oh. Guys, next week, guess what we're going to do? We're gonna do portraits, not puppy portraits like we did last time. Yeah. We're gonna do self portraits, or you can actually paint a portrait of anybody you'd like. I'm gonna paint her. Well, of course. Look at me, gorgeous. I've been dying to paint you, girl. So all you're gonna need next week is paint, a few brushes, some small ones, and something to paint on. What? It's gonna be really You simple. gotta have a picture. Remember, true, you story, a true story. True story. Pick who mirror. you want to paint. You can use a mirror. If you want to paint yourself, it's easier though to have a picture of yourself. Just like clip it next to your next to your canvas or your piece of paper that yeah, you're drawing. Yeah, we'll show on. you next. Or week use crowns if you'd like. But listen, it's really simple to do a self portrait, and we're dying to see what you guys put together. So if you leave a comment, or if you will, um, you know, email us or find a way to just show us. You can post on Facebook, you can post on Instagram, um, all of the different ways. We want to see your portraits. Of course we want to see your portraits. And I know you want to see this one, so come back next week. We'll be here Saturday, 8.30 a.m. Central Time for Portraits. Portraits! We're going to paint Iris. Thanks, you guys. Have a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye! Bye! -bye. Bye. Dance off! Valentine's gift that you can pick and give to anybody that you'd like. Yeah, you like, like, me, like me. Yeah. Do you want to take this one? I thought you, you made it, it for me. Well, of course I made it. You for probably you. made it for Matt. I love Matt.
Don't you love Matt? <laughs> oh my. You know, Matt well, he loves does, you. He does take care of me though. Matt loves you too. He's he combs me all the time. I know. He makes sure you're... I bet he's combed me 15 times today. At least. Your apron's always tied up in the back and your bow's all right. Matt takes really special care of you. So oh, yeah. maybe I should give it to Matt or do you want to give it to him? I'll give it to him. Okay. All right. You guys, you can give yours to anybody. So that means you have to give me a present yep. and Matt a present. Oh. That's okay. I love giving gifts, and especially on Valentine's Day. Do you have like a love poem or like a love story you want to tell? Um, you know, eight-year-olds have lots of love stories. Oh. Roses are red, violets are blue. That's all I got. Okay, how about this? Roses are red, uh -huh. violets are blue. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting. I think you're pretty cool. You think I am too. <laughs> Here. Here for the five. Here for the five. It was better than what you said. You said nothing. I know, that's part of the poem. <laughs> Silence. Fill in the blank. Silence, fill in the blank. Mine's a fill in the blank poem. Yours is a finish for yourself, Roses well, are Red yeah. poem. No, do you have any big plans for Valentine's Day? Are you going to go to the daddy-daughter dance again? No, nah, we don't have that anymore. What? Yeah, I know. It's crazy. It was a lot of fun. Oh, man. Well, um, maybe Matt would take you to the movies or do a dinner or dance with you. Yeah, we hang out all the time. Yeah. Was that you? Is that you? <laughs> Oh, God, Seriously, Abby. That is, Abby. That is disgusting. <laughs> Abby, that's what happens when we let the dog out while we're trying to do the show.